One of the new faces on the Kelowna Falcons this year is a big pitcher out of Gonzaga. Six foot six inch, 230 pound right hander Carl Myers played last season with the Bellingham Bells. And in Kelowna, he will start the season as a reliever. Myers has been throwing in the high 80s, low 90s in college ball with good location. He's one of those pitchers with the ability to get batters to ground out. I mostly work uh, fastball change, uh, not really necessarily a power guy. Uh, mostly work on getting contact using the defense. So fastball change are my two main pitches. Uh, work down in the zone and just kind of try and get guys to roll over and stuff. So you're sort of hoping them to, to ground out in the infield kind of thing? Is that your... Yeah, definitely. I'm more kind of a ground ball pitcher. Uh, try and work down. I'm a pretty tall guy, so I like to use a little bit of angle on my ball and miss a barrel as much as I possibly can. He's got numbers where you know he's a high ground ball percentage guy, so he's working on a cutter. He probably sinks the ball a little bit too to get some ground balls. So. Um, We'll definitely need him out of the pens here. The cutter is a cut fastball, which breaks as it reaches home plate. It's usually thrown faster than a slider, but with more motion than a fastball. Mariano Rivera made the pitch famous. Often called the poor man's slider, the cutter will be Meyer's fourth pitch. And right now, it's a work in progress. It's hit and miss a little bit. It's kind of a love-hate for me. I uh, haven't quite thrown it in games yet, uh, but I've been working on it for about four or five months. You know, we'll work with him in the bullpen um, when he has off days, that type of stuff. So we'll help develop him with his mechanics and, you know, different grips, cutters. It, it's a feel pitch, so we'll, we'll help him out with that. Myers was a multi-sport athlete that also played basketball and football, but baseball was really in his blood. He grew up in Seattle cheering for the Mariners. There, he watched a very tall pitcher, Randy Johnston, all six foot ten inches of him. And like that flamethrower, he tries to use his size to his advantage. It's one of those things where mechanically, me and my coach back at school work on, you know, staying tall and, and trying to use as much of my legs as can, I can and create angle with the ball and everything. Catching for Myers will be Anthony or A.J. Young, a six foot three inch, 205 pounder from Gilbert, Arizona. He attends the University of Utah in Salt Lake. He learned the position largely from his dad, Donnie, who played some games in the Oakland A system. Taught me from, since I can remember, he was my high school coach, so he was my coach through the whole time. And uh, what kinds of things did he teach you then? Just playing the game right. What's that for a catcher? Uh, hustle on and off the field, good energy, good focus. It's a demanding position too, isn't it, really, when you think about it? You're in every play, so you got to be ready every pitch. Can't take anything for granted. AJ's a young guy. Um, of the University of Utah, you know, he comes from a storied program. Uh, you know, he, he's an athlete. He's a big kid with with a with a good stick. So, um, behind the plate, no, you know, we haven't seen him catch really, but just going off what his coach said, he's a good defensive catcher. So, you know, another guy we have high expectations for as well. This is the second go round for head coach Jeff White, a former Falcon himself. He expects this year's squad to be an athletic team. I hope to establish that we're a hard-working team. We play the, play the game the right way. We've got a lot of athletes on this team, a lot of new guys, new faces. So um, I think we're going to bring an exciting brand of baseball. There's a lot of guys who, who are great athletes who can run, who can hit the ball a long way too. And we also got some athletes on the mound that you know can throw the ball quite well. So um, I think we're going to have a good group.